this is the part where I would normally say my name's Russell and I'm an addict. That's true and will remain true for the rest of my life. This is about the 25th time I've tried this video. <laughs> not try I'm trying not to panic. I'm just going to share a small story with you um, about five or six years ago during um, the madness of addiction. A friend of mine lent me a rather expensive guitar. Um, being an addict, I pawned that guitar in the shop. Um, the same night, the shop burnt down to the ground, taking the guitar with it. Um, wasn't It wasn't just my friend's guitar, it was actually his dead brother's guitar. So you can imagine the sentimental value. Um, he suffice to say he never wanted to speak to me again, and I haven't spoken to him since. Um, jumping five or six years, I'm now a recovering recovered addict, and I have to do a lot of work to stay that way. Um, my, I'm now married, and my partner and I joined an alpha course. I think I was there to debunk it within a couple of sessions. Yeah, um, but it didn't work out that way. I met some lovely people, heard some lovely stories, read some lovely scripture, and actually took from it the spiritual life I was already trying to leave lead was um, tied in very well with a Christian life and so I grabbed it with both hands um, which brings us to now so a couple of weeks ago the PlayStation 5 came out and I know it's a fascinating story for a lot of us but about 10 to 9 there was a group of five or six of us ready to purchase it at 9 a.m. in the morning when it came out and at 10 to 9 I get this overwhelming sense of guilt and the way I put it is God tripped me up. Um, I just I ended up phoning a friend really close to me saying that I can't buy this PlayStation. Um, I have an amends to make. <laughs> you know, because cause God's in my way. Um, um, so we sent we sent this guy who lent me the guitar message saying um, I'm in a position to make a financial amends any time before over the last few years I've wanted to speak to him the problem with it was I knew it was only to make myself feel better and not to help him so I sent that message and cutting a long story short he took some money from me he gave it to his son and his grandkids for Christmas and told me that his brother his rest in peace um, would be very grateful um, we are looking to meet up again and when all this mayhem is over, meet up for a hug. Um, that I can honestly and truly say, I honestly believe God um, was running that day. Um, took everything that I thought I was controlling out of my hands and it was all God's will. Um, and I have Alpha to thank for that. I have a wonderful, lovely life today, and I have Alpha, God, Jesus, love, all of it to thank for that. Looking back to where I was, I, I was a mess and probably didn't have long left on this earth. But um, a, a light was shown and a path I did follow. I'm just going to finish it with my name's Russell and I'm a Christian. Um, Thank you.